Come and listen. Come to the water's edge, all you know and fear the Lord. Come and listen. Come to the water's edge, all you. We had this really passionate belief that it takes different types of churches to reach different types of people. Um, we knew there was existing churches that were definitely reaching an existing segment of uh, the community, but we also knew that uh, there was a new expression of Christianity that was needed out in this area. Now, our first worship service was a quarter mile away from uh, the largest church in Nebraska. There's a Catholic church with over 15,000 members, and they were doing great work, but we just knew that uh, they weren't reaching everybody. And we came out here and uh, just had this belief that healthy Christians uh, develop healthy Christians, healthy small groups, uh, develop healthy new small groups, and healthy churches will develop healthy new churches. So uh, you know, we just see all other churches as collaboration, and we see ourselves as uh, you know, just one small expression of you know, Christianity within the United Methodist tradition. And you know, it's, just, it's been a blessing to thousands of people over these uh, last 10 years. The name of the Water's Edge comes from uh, the Gospel of Mark, chapter 3, where Jesus was uh, at the lake shore, the water's edge, and there were so many people there that he had to actually get onto a boat. And there Jesus spoke to the people at the water's edge. And I, I was running one day and I listened to that song and, uh, you know, come and listen. And right when I heard it, I knew where it was from and I knew that was the name of the church. I had never heard it before. And I just love the vision of uh, the people coming to the water's edge to hear the teachings of Jesus. And, and when that happens, like our life will change. And because our life change, changes, uh, the world will change as well. One of the things that we find is that people, um, they want to belong. And when they belong to a group, we can become more like Christ uh, you know, through that uh, process of uh, belonging. We have grown from uh, just one small group of people 12 years ago, and today I would estimate we probably had about a thousand people here. Um, it's been so fun to watch it grow over the last uh, decade or so, and one of the things I said today is that chapter one is now done, and chapter two uh, starts today. Um, one of the things we've always done since the beginning is we've encouraged people to invite, uh, to be invitational, to bring their friends. And you know, I made that uh, I made that plea again today. There's uh, the, the best way that we've experienced growth over the years is you know through those personal invitations. People want to be part of a church that is uh, making a difference. They want to be part of a church that's creative. They want to be part of a church that is just radically investing and in loving their kids and their their little ones. I have been going to the Water's Edge since middle school, so it has been a long time coming to see the building itself and worship through Millard West and be involved in all of these families and the building, and it's just been the greatest gift to be able to be here today. We're a church for, for everybody, and uh, just if you uh, are looking for a place to uh, where you can get connected, or a place where you can grow closer to God, grow closer to other people, uh, a place where you want to serve and uh, have an opportunity to make a difference. We're the church for you, so we just invite you to come uh, uh, to our worship and invite us to you to get connected in our ministries and in our serving. We've been in the Methodist Church all of our lives and received a card for the very first Sunday that the Water's Edge started and have been here ever since. We just, you know, we built this for God. We built this uh, for Omaha. Um, it's not for us and, you know, we're just uh, humbled and honored to, you know, be a small part of what God's doing here in West Omaha. And, throughout Omaha, throughout the metro area, throughout Nebraska, and really in the Methodist, uh, United Methodist Church throughout the world.
sound all together. <laughs> 